Hello, my name's Luke Hebbs and I'm from RLR UK. Welcome to my third video demonstration of Trustee's Rapport, showing you how it combats spyware on your machine. In this third demonstration, we're going to be looking at Spy Shelter Security Test Tool. Now, as you can see from the screen, this has several components. The uh, two that we're actually interested in, we're going to look at now though, are the key logging and the screenshot capabilities. So I've got a web browser here with Google in it and let's start um, the test with key logging. So as soon as I start typing we should see um, the keys appearing there. So if I navigate to one of Trustee's partner sites, HSBC, I'm going to type it all in because hopefully you will see as I do that in the background here you can see that um, Spy Shelter has actually picked up all that text HSBC Internet Banking exactly what I actually typed let's now go and open up their um, personal internet banking login page now you may or may not be able to read this this is the same as in my uh, previous demonstrations it says welcome input internet banking user ID e.g. IB12345678900 so we're going to do exactly that and type in IB12345678900 and then log on now in the background here we should see that that has actually come out as ABCDEFGHIJKL not uh, um, as the text I actually typed in similarly if we go to the date of birth here so we'll make up a date of birth of the 12th of the 3rd, 64. And the first, second, and fourth digits of the security number, we'll just type in 1, 2, and 4. And again, you can see in the background here that the date of birth came out as A, B, C, D, E, F. And the security number came out as A, B, F. Okay, the same thing will happen for their um, other sites as well. So we can stop that test now. What about if we look at um, the screenshot capabilities? So go to the screenshot capabilities and when we click start test, it will just take a, a screenshot. So this is just doing one screenshot at a time. Uh, so you get, you'll see if I click it again, then the picture, the screenshot actually appears, so on and so forth. Okay, so we've managed to take a screen grab with Google there. Now if I switch back to the HSBC site that's got my um, banking user ID here, let's have a look at what happens now. So we click start test again to take another screenshot and it's totally blank. If I go back to Google and click again we get it back and just to prove that it is actually working we'll click it again and again it changes. Okay, but importantly, we are not able to perform screen capture or key logging on a Trustee protected site. You can tell that it's, it's actually protected by Trustee by the green Trustee logo in the address bar, uh, which can be checked and tested to show that it is actually HSBC and that it is properly encrypted. Okay, that's the end of this demonstration.